y'all today i'm making one of my favorite side dishes and that is the hash brown casserole that they have at cracker barrel i love going there um it's kind of like a holiday thing for me but uh to go with family but uh there's always such a long line so i've got a bag of hash brown potatoes that I have thawed out and i've got half a medium onion that i've diced and i'm gonna put it all together i like to be adding one can of cream of chicken soup. I didn't realize that that was like the secret ingredient, but I found this recipe online. I gave it a shot and it was amazing. So this is how I get my Cracker Barrel fix when I can't be bothered to like go wait in line <laughs> or if I just want some by myself. So next ingredient is going to be an entire pint of sour cream. Go ahead and put that in there. See if it, there we go. See if it cooperates. See, look, all clean. And continue to keep mixing that together. And then we're gonna also add some black pepper. I'm not adding any salt because there's plenty of salt in that chicken soup concentrate. About, I don't know, quarter teaspoon, half teaspoon, whatever you think. Ooh, hey, it got stuck. Um, is appropriate for you. Some people like it pepperier, pepperier. I think that's the word than others. Then our last ingredient that goes into this. Whew, this is so good, y'all. You, you have to make this. Is shredded Colby Jack cheese. So this is a two cup bag, right? So I'm gonna use a cup and a half. Goes right in here. And I'm saving, saving half a cup for later. Okay, so once that's all in there, you can actually kind of like wipe this off and then just use the bag to kind of mix it all together. And once that's done, just go ahead and turn that right on out. Continue to mix it together. Okay, so once all that's mixed together, let's go ahead and top it with the rest of that Colby Jack cheese. And then this is gonna go into that 350 degree oven for about 45 to 50 minutes. We'll be right back. Ooh, take a look. Doesn't that look amazing? Oh, it smells so good in here. I'm gonna add just a little bit of parsley. I don't remember if Cracked Barrel does this, but you know, I just figure a little green makes it look a little pretty. What's your favorite side dish over a Cracker Barrel? I'm like, I'll just go and, you know, just get hash brown casserole, I'll just be real happy. And I think that's kind of one of the things I like the most about this dish is the fact that I can have as much of this as I want. Cause when I go to Cracker Barrel, I end up ordering like, you know, a couple extra portions and I probably am embarrassing myself. So this way I can have a whole pan. So let me go ahead and cut into this. Oh, looks so good. Ooh, it's all steamy. Oof. It smells so good, y'all. It's like that cream of chicken soup and the sour cream and all that Colby Jack. You know it's gonna taste amazing. Hot though. Oh, it is so good. You guys have to make this. If you like Cracker Barrel, hash brown casserole, this is exactly what it tastes like. 